Series is Car 67. It's Car 67. We're code 5. Code 5. Nothing to report. We've got nothing to report. One fourteen a.m. I have to put this on. Moses falls asleep, hits head on steering wheel, it's honks horn, gets slobber all over car. I think we can leave that out of the report. Why you want to do everything by the book, right, big guy? Huh? Finished. Written in stone. There you go. What do you see? Nothing. Just a. Oh, shit, he's breaking in. Come on, let's go. You don't know that. He's peeking in the window, Moses. That doesn't mean he's breaking in. Look at him. Okay, loitering, maybe public intoxication, maybe, but I'm not wasting my time on a loiterer just because you're uncomfortable with a certain type of person. Certain type of person? Are you calling me what I think you're calling me? You know good and well that's what you were thinking. No, I was thinking his actions are suspicious. I'm just saying we shouldn't jump to conclusions just because this fine gentleman is African American. Oh, there's a, there's, a, there's a conclusion. There's a racist conclusion right there. How do you know he's African American, huh? He could be African Jamaican. He could be African Luxembourgian. How do you know? Oh, so, hey, hey. He's probably drunk and has to break into his house because he doesn't have a key. Who in this car can understand being drunk and breaking into your own home? Chance? You know, that was a pretty cheap shot, Moses. I broke into my own house to prove to Teresa that I'd moved on, okay? By the way, I don't think it's weird that a black guy dressed like that would live in this neighborhood. There, I said it. Why do you feel you have to clarify that? I mean, he's probably a really successful record producer. Come on! Are you really gonna shoot an African-American, registered firearm owner, protecting his own home? Okay, he's a patriot. You know what I think? Enlighten me, please. I think you're worried that you're a racist, and if you arrest a black man, it's gonna prove it. Okay, I'm racist, sure. Would a racist donate to every single black Kickstarter out there? I don't think so. Oh, okay. Let me guess. That's his wife, and he's, uh, he's, he's come home early to surprise her. Is that what it is? Or they're engaging in some sexual role play. I mean, one time my wife had me hide in the bushes and surprise her on her jogging route. And then uh, I surprised her, I surprised her again, and then uh, she surprised me. Really? That's pretty hot, man. Yeah, it's, um, it's been a lot tamer since the kids. I voted for Obama! I didn't vote, but I live in a blue state! You should always try to Same vote. thing! You should always Same vote! Thing. Man. You are under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. This has nothing to do with you being black. Anything you say you can and will. Classic black sitcom. What the hell's going on? He was clearly breaking into your house, ma'am. No. We are into some adventurous love making. I pretend to break in, and she gets all nasty and into it. It's fantasy, motherfucker. And then you tackle me right on my dick. Feels all twisted, like maybe he broke it. You can't break a dick. Can you break a dick? Can you break a dick? Very much so, yes. Oh. Ah! Oh. Oh. Neighborhood watch, stay down! We're cops, get off of me, you idiot! As far as I can tell, y'all just a couple of white dudes with guns up to no good. Nobody holds up a successful record producer in my neighborhood. Record producer? I call that. Keeping property values high, motherfucker. <laughs> That's what we do.